Good evening. Dozens of grocery stores in northeast Indiana are affected by a nationwide fruit recall. Certain peaches, nectarines, plums, and pluots could be contaminated with listeria. News Channel 15's Alyssa Ivinson is live at the Kroger store on West State Boulevard with what you need to know. The recalled fruit has already been taken off the shelves, so what's out in the displays now is safe to eat. But if you bought any certain uh, peaches or nectarines or plums between June 1st and July 12th, you could be affected by the recall. We will get communication to the stores right away. Wawona Packing Company out of California issued a voluntary recall. Certain peaches, nectarines, and plums could be contaminated with listeria. There have been no known illnesses, but the company's pulling the produce as a precaution. The recall only applies if you bought the fruit between June 1st and July 12th. In northeast Indiana, the Kroger Company stores, Costco, and Sam's Club are affected. So we call our members right away as soon as the recall is announced. Sam's Club members and Kroger Plus card holders who bought the recalled fruit would also get phone calls. Kroger has a great database and, and through that loyalty card we can actually reach out to the customers that particularly bought that item. So we're not reaching out to, to somebody that didn't, we're, we're reaching out to those folks that actually bought that item. The recalled produce has already been pulled. In this particular case, the product is destroyed. Uh, obviously, we don't want that product getting back onto the sales floors. A sign in Kroger also makes sure anyone who might have purchased the possibly contaminated fruit is aware the fruit would have a sticker on it that says sweet to eat. People should throw it out and can bring in their receipt to get a refund or credit toward other items. And if they have questions, and we have this from time to time, even though it might not be part of that recall, you know, we're, we're going we're to make sure that customers feels comfortable. If you bought any of the recalled fruit, Kroger will also print out a recall notice the next time you're in the store, and it actually just prints out right on the bottom of your receipt. But what if you already ate that recalled fruit? Well, health officials say to just watch out for any symptoms that might be like the flu, like fever or muscle aches and diarrhea. And if you have any of those symptoms in the next couple of months, go to a doctor. But right now, there have been no known listeria infections as related to this recall of the fruit. Live in Fort Wayne, Alyssa Ivinson, News Channel 15.